Fishing in the Florida Keys has provided 15-year-old Will with some exciting catches. Yes! But now, Peter has a new angling adventure in store for his guest. Will's dad, Chris, still had a bunch of work to do. He'd been flying and traveling a lot. So Will kind of looked at me and I said, Will, you ever heard of peacock bass? He goes, yeah. I said, you want to go catch him? He was all in. So here we are. We're in the canal and we're in search of the elusive peacock bass. Just going through that was amazing, you know, because it's so close and you just feel like you're in a totally different place. I mean, you are, you know? And we just hauled butt through these winding canals by these homes. It's really neat landscape and we're following it on the uh, Ray Marini. It's really, really neat experience. All right, well, this area right up in here, they like to hang out by these culverts and um, I think we're going to stake out, throw a couple of baits right up in here. What do you think? It sounds good. All right, cool, cool. The peacock bass fishing in Miami is second to none. So I thought, you know, what a nice way to spend the day while his dad's working. Go put him on some peacock and have a great day in the canals. Get ready, get ready. Let's just start whining, just start whining. Whining, keep your tip up. There he is. There you go. And keep whining. Bring him in, and that's it. Just slide him towards me. Don't reel anymore. Nice. Sweet. Nice. Yes. Nice. These peacocks were brought to Miami back in the 80s from South America. People traveled from all over the world to target these peacock bass. Yeah, Congrats, first man. peacock bass. That is so cool. That's the beauty of what we have in Florida. Whether you're gonna fish offshore, inshore, freshwater, saltwater, doesn't matter. You can pretty much target something at any day, any turn you make, right or left, you're gonna find somewhere to fish. He just boiled on the bait right there, ready? Chris point, there you go. You got him, you got him on, buddy. I was feeling like a tug, and I saw my tip going down. There you go, there you go, buddy. Oh, that's a nice one. You really turned into a pro here, buddy, I like it. He's coming, he's That one's bigger, that one's bigger than the first one. You got it, grab him tight, there. It's into fatty. It is a fatty, it looks like it's been eating all day. I'm surprised they ate any more. Dude, that is awesome. It was a nice little fight. Dude. Nice, man. Yeah. Good job. Congratulations. That's bigger than the other one. That's number two. The colors on them are just amazing, and the fight is just amazing. And having the second one be bigger than the first one is even better, you know? You did a great job. Great job all around, man, from, from yeah. salt water to fresh water, from bass to billfish. <laughs> <laughs> just as we finished up peacock bass fishing, I get a call, and the bite was starting to turn on, so the timing couldn't have been better. We hopped in the car, went right back down to the Chica Lodge, put the boat away, and it was time to go out for what, we, what they came down for, which was tarpon. 